Hi, in this video, I would like to show you how you can translate your WordPress content with the help of AI. After installing Polylang Automatic Translation with AI and Polylang Pro, you are ready to go. If you also want to translate your product content for WooCommerce, you also need the Polylang for WooCommerce plugin. Now that we have installed the plugins, let's move on. First, we need to connect our OpenAI key. Via this OpenAI key, you can connect to the AI to translate your content. You will find more instructions under this link. I'm first going to show you how to translate posts. Then I'm going to show you how to translate pages, then products, and last, I'm going to translate product categories with the help of the bulk translator. Now first, let's do posts. Here I created a simple post. Here you find a button that states generate update translations with AI. If you click it and click OK, the translation process starts. Translations generated updated successfully. Now you can see two translated versions are added. Let's check the Spanish version. And here you can see a Spanish translation translated by AI, included markup. Now let's try to translate a page. This time the German version. Now let's try to translate a WooCommerce product. Again. Spanish translated version. Now that we have translated three post types, let's check out the categories. But the cat categories are not translated yet. So therefore we can use the bulk translator. First, click product categories, save settings. There are two translations available. Start the bulk translation process. Bulk translation is activated and about to start running. Bulk translation is running. Here you can see categories are translated already. And now it's done. If we go back to categories, we see that both the German and Spanish versions are, cat are translated. Now last, I would like to show you the menu function. Let's go to menus. Let's create a main menu. Create a menu. Add a contact page. A product and the English product categories. Let's add nesting. Let's add this here. Save the settings. Now create another menu. Main menu for German connected to German and now you have the option to get the English menu as source and convert it to the German translated items. Save the menu 
and now you have the menu in German. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you will enjoy translating your WordPress content with this plugin.